Welcome back, mayors. My name's to Craven. This is some more City Skylines playing After Dark. And, well, it's actually clear blue sky right now during the day, so that's a little bit different. But I've um, done some work on the city. Um, I have indeed connected the highway across the river here. Um, too bad we didn't get any nice suspension bridge this time around, but... That, those might actually only happen if you make it a straight bridge, to be honest. If I do this... Yeah, it needs to be straight, and it's not an actual straight bridge right now. Maybe I'll fix that in the future sometime, because I wouldn't mind having the look of it, at least. Currently, they're looking for workers everywhere. I started on some downtown shops uh, around the plaza, so you can see the beginning... There will be a lot of stuff added to this in the near future. But I first need to unlock the actual leisure areas. So right now, I'm just expanding the city with people, with places to for people to go to. Um, high school is fine. Elementary school is fine. Crime is good. Detained criminals, 11. Yeah, how, my, how much room is there in one prison? Um, prison van capacity five vans okay police headquarters police station doesn't actually give you the amount of um, jails it has but we have one police station so that's 20 jails obviously um, health is there are no sick citizens right now Ooh, we need a cemetery I think we only recently unlocked it though so that is fine um, I think I'm gonna place it here there we go, cemetery. I really don't mind having more than one cemetery in the city. Um, especially not even when uh, the crem crematoria are unlocked, really. Oh, sun is going down and there's fire. The fire department is responding everywhere. That's good. What happened, people? Did you drop uh, something hot? They dropped it like it's hot, so and then it started burning. They're not concerning, I guess. Um, I still need something of everything. I think, mostly, what we need to do is add more parks. So we can have more upgraded areas going. I believe a Paradox Plaza is 5x5 five five as well. Rather have just a Zen Garden over here. Um, I simply want it facing the other way, though. Uh, yeah, so I build an avenue that reaches all the way from the highway. I just made a simple on and off ramp system for now. Uh, it's probably not the most efficient one you can have at all. But for now, it's doing its job to allow people into the city. We can also connect over here. But for that, we're going to need... I want to build the three way intersection um how did that go again was that with right yeah so this needs to be about like this slope too steep seriously oh man then i cannot even build it here if the slope is too steep oh no that's here it's perfectly fittable yeah it the area where we would actually have Okay, yeah. Area, space is just occupied. Mm, it should be doable. It's going to be rough, though. Okay, that should fit. Okay, those are fitting. It actually looks pretty decent. Um, you go this way. And then... With a slight curve. Keep connecting like that. And this will end up in a... Uh, um, a dead end for the highway at least. And that it will probably split into a six lane avenue. That leads straight into downtown. 
But yeah, I chose a four lane avenue. Also, the downtown area has bus lanes, so those will be used by the buses mostly. So yeah, I've added another bus route that is going to go through the area here straight to downtown and back. Um, okay. Uh, no. How do we select a... Uh, oh. Select a line. Does it have to do through this menu? I think so. There you go. Line color. Um, day and night. Yeah, this should be a day and night one. Let's make it dark blue. Oh, actually... Um, 34 weekly passenger... Well, weekly passenger, 34 residents and one tourist... Four vehicles, car trip saved, 38. How about this one? This is a... Yeah, um, let's do this one just during the day. Because it's for working people. It's not for leisure or something. So we have night buses going to downtown from our area over here, which is fine. Um, I've been using uh, some bigger areas as well to... Um, for people to live and such. Yeah, I think here is where we'll have another sort of cul-de-sac area-ish thing. Um, something like this. Doesn't look very great though. No, doesn't. Just remove it then. I mean, we could fit. Yeah, it doesn't actually fit. Road in the middle would be one too small. You know what? I won't build anything on here anyway. Some more houses. I usually try to avoid avenues with bigger houses, but... Um, okay, good point. We want this to be empty and this to be empty. I will build a bike lane that goes underneath here. Apparently needs to be longer. Needs to be five in length to go to a reasonable position. There we go. We can get it back up again. Um, that's not the bike path though. The bike path is over there. one's simply too close <sighs> sometimes the game doesn't do what you want it to do There we go, and now we have a path that goes underneath here for the bikes. I like getting my bike path going on. Um, still no bike roads available though. Uh, next level actually though, including the three roads as well. Next level. Seriously, there are people going to school during the night I don't think that's a thing see yeah the budget is actually only during the day I and no night budget should be a lot lower like a lot lower for the uh, 
schools. No one should be working or should be going to school at night for crying out loud. There we go, have some water. Still at 42 power. We've been at 42 for a while now, actually. Interesting. Uh, let's see, let's add a few more bike paths. Uh, something till there, and then we go underground again. And exit up there. Slowly moving the um, industry over to this area too. So it doesn't all get clogged down in the same area. Um, that's morning starts. And also that was the cemetery bell, I think, actually. What should I do with this area, though? Hmm, it's completely empty so far. Uh, it's gonna be annoying. To think of what I should put here, at least. Ooh, level 3 buildings have unlocked. I don't have anything yet. Weekly education expenses, 20,000. Bloody hell. 10,000 squares of office. A way too high crime rate. A grand mall. People always like to shop tourists even more so. Ah yes, the European building, like the Gherkin. I would really like to just have the Gherkin at some point. Hub for financial business and has a very nice restaurant with a 360 degree view at the top. Department store, city extracts a total of 8,000 units of natural resources. Oof. Hypermarket, a lot of commercial zone. Government offices, an average garbage piling per building, at least 40. Cathedral, 2,000 abandoned buildings. Amsterdam Palace constructs 600 city service buildings. That's like everything, and that's a lot. Public transport has 3,000 weekly passengers. City Hall will actually be easy to get. I always go very much on... Um, public transport in fact I have not yet set my policy because it's not available yet hmm. um, let's see let's start divvying this up a little bit more so this will be a neighborhood uh, this will be mostly a neighborhood um, not that, this area. Daffodil District. Also, yeah, let's remove... Oh, hang on, that's right. Mm -hmm. There we go, and let's... Remove most of the area on the other side of the tracks. Because downtown is actually just this side of the tracks. I could work more on the road layout here. Actually gonna start... Um, yeah, I cannot really add right now to this. Because of the... A bit, because of the power lines. Words, right? Yeah, um, bus taxi lane. Let's do that without this. If we make this a straight one, straight one, it's gonna look like that. Okay, that's actually a pretty cool looking bridge. In my opinion. Okay, that just looks really wonky. So 
something like this should work. So we now have another place to cross the river where we can actually add another connection to a highway that could lead into the downtown area. Which is good. So we're going to need a six lane highway or six lane um, road here as well. Okay, that's they also come with bike lanes as well, which is good. So it's going to be over here. And I'm going to go underneath the tracks here. Oh, I'm actually running out of money right now. So this will eventually look hook up to the um, only 40,000 left here. Oh boy. Let's get another one of loans. A small loan this time. I need to get back up though. Something like this and then connect it. Um, yeah, there will be some stuff up here to sort of hide it. But not necessarily completely. Um, this is the left lane, so this needs to go roughly till here. I'll use you as a guide and then flip you over, of course. There we go. And that sh will connect over here um, in a roundabout to be honest this should be a roundabout and let's make it a big one Probably still in the wrong direction, but ah, fine. Um, why is this connection? I see indeed indeed um, left hand so that works it's a big roundabout it's actually not circle anymore though well we have another highway connection available so people can get into the city here but also here buses are over there working tirelessly Going back and forth between downtown and the city. Going downtown. Yeah. I need more trees over here. So it doesn't look as empty as it actually is. There's enough room on the map to build a very sprawling big city. So for now, this is um, where we are in the center, at least. Hello, cemetery. Mm, actually, you can be filled in now. As can you and you. Uh, sure, why not over here? To there. All the way till here. And there. More room for people to move in. Perfectly fine. And this shopping area. I need more shopping in downtown, to be honest. But I want the high density to go here first, really.
<laughs> um, let's cancel this and actually put a park in here instead. Too small, slightly too small, way too big. Sure. That seems like a reasonable park to me. That leads us uh, with another bike path to go with. I would like to thank you all for watching. Make sure to like this city if you enjoyed it. And subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date in the future with more videos. I'll see you guys later.